All right, it's still the Friday Flex edition of The Breakfast on Plus TV Africa. So, top trending. What are the things trending on social media and indeed in the country right now and even globally? All right, so let's start with the good news from the federal government. The federal government has okayed the reopening of Seme border for vehicle importation. I imagine those who import vehicles find this uh, good news. Uh, they've approved the opening of that border uh, for the importation of vehicles. Uh, the Director of Road Transport in the Ministry of Transportation revealed this. Uh, his name is uh, Ibrahim Musa, and he revealed that during an ECOWAS meeting organized between officials of Nigeria and Benin. Uh, so the Customs Area Controller of Seme Border Command, Dera Nadi, said the service had noticed a reduction in its revenue since the importation of vehicles was banned from the land border. So they've opened the borders, the semi border, so that uh, vehicles can come in. And of course, they need the revenue. So that kind of explains that. And uh, I imagine that's good news for those who import vehicles from that window, from that axis. Although some have raised some questions uh, with regard to other ways of bringing things into the country and of course the excise duties of course uh, which have led to the uh, reduction in the importation of vehicles into the country uh, will that be revisited will that be reviewed those are some of the questions stakeholders in that sector are, ask, are asking uh, today as or was since yesterday when this news broke so semi border has been reopened. Second top trending, fire raises plank market in Ogun. What do we know about this fire? Well, it happened at the Olusesi market in Ado Odo Ota, LGA in Ogun State. That fire uh, happened around 10 a.m. from what we understand, and it was caused by some um, you know, past search as a result of past search. But thankfully, uh, members of the fire service were able to put it out before it spread to some other parts of the market. So they came right on time and did their thing quite swiftly and they saved the day. So kudos to them. Fire raises the plank market in Ogun State. A similar incident occurred two years ago in that same place. Of course, we know that uh, plank markets are usually very volatile and more care needs to be taken, I guess, by those who sell in those markets to avoid such incidents from happening. But in this case, it says power search. So probably it was something that they could not help. But thank God that uh, the fire service of the Ota Command responded swiftly and did put out the fire before it spread to other sections of that market, the fire plant market in Ogun State. All right, we'll take a break now and come back with Off the Press, where we look at the front pages on some major dailies this morning. An analyst will be joining us to break down some of those headlines, the major and the minor headlines on some national dailies this morning. Do stay with us. We'll be back in a jiffy. <laughs> 